Hey, Biagio here with Nate Orloff. Nate is uh, one of our AEs, becoming our new lead AE here at Joke Productions, and he has his iPad that just came in. Now, since everybody is showing, uh, you know, the iPad doing basic everyday things, I thought we'd show some things that are kind of specific for, for production. Nate, you haven't had a whole lot of time to play with this yet, right? Yeah. This just kind of came in. I got this this morning, and um, one of the things I got was uh, a screen sharing app, and there's lots of different ones. But this one works with the iPhone and iPad, it's universal. So I set up, I just put the IP address of uh, whatever computers we have in the network. We have about 30 different computers. And I, as you can see, this Wow, you're is, like sharing that screen right now that's in front right. of us. Right. So I can go around and just hand and zoom, tap on this, bring up the keyboard, and just screen share. Now, wait a minute, wait, did you just actually start playing the video clip from your iPad? Yeah, it's right now it's playing. And now this may not seem very useful when the computer's right in front of me, but if someone is having trouble with another computer down the hall, we can save time by, I can just screen share if I know it's a simple solution of me just changing a preference file, you know, I can just do this and their problems fix instantly and then they can just keep rolling. So you can pretty much hop on any, because we have about 30 computers here between edit bays and story bays, so you can hop on any one of those just from your little iPad here and fix a lot of problems. I can, I can do this to any computer, any iMac, any Mac Pro we have connected, I can do this to a server for having server issues, and um, I'm even looking to set it up remotely, so from home, I can maybe even check on the server. What? I know. Get out of here. As long as there's an internet connection, then the server should be able to connect. So can you get actually, how, how hard would it be for you to connect to the server right now so we can actually... Oh, I'll just relaunch the application. And I already have the IP address of the server saved. So mm -hmm. I just tap that. Right. Connects pretty fast. It's 802.11n, so it's, you know, really fast. And now I'm connected to the server. So, so, so right now you're actually screen sharing off our server right there. That's, that's the, yeah, that's, that's our Mac OS X server on, a, on an Xserve with a promise raid. Wow, and it's my Cinema 4D uh, net render farm. So One I, of the things I always got you stopping and starting is the, is the Cinema 4D net render. So you can right. do that from here. I can, I can, I can quit this from here. If, if we're using a, a massive render and you know, we don't want to you know, take up all the computers to, to do a screen share, I can just use my iPad instead. That's my intention is that I can fix problems. I mean, 90% of the issues have, we have with editors or story editors working on Final Cut is something that's very, I know the problem, I just, it's, they would take way more time to walk them through it, how to fix it, but you know, usually it takes so much more time to just go there, fix the problem, show them how. If I can just do this super quick and be like, on the phone, be like, I can fix your computer from here. Now, one of the reasons you got an iPad is because you don't have a laptop, right? I don't have a laptop. I have a Mac Pro at home for my editing, uh, 8 gigs of RAM, 3.2 gigahertz, you know, it's, it's, it's really fast editing machine. I love it. And I don't want to spend $1,200 or even $1,000 on a laptop that all I do is like browse and do email. So like, I was, as soon as the iPad came out, I knew it was perfect for me. Wow. Well, all right. Well, there you go, folks. The first installment from Nate Orloff. Uh, what's your Twitter, Nate? Uh, at Nate Orloff. No spaces. O-R-L-O-F-F. -F. All right. Nate Orloff. Follow him on Twitter, folks. Thanks, Nate. No problem.